49 states, it's just basketball. But here, it's Indiana. When most people think of what the original Assembly Hall stood for, most people's minds tend to gravitate towards legendary men's basketball coach, Bob Knight. Bob Knight became synonymous with Indiana men's basketball, and in his 29 seasons, no one can deny him that distinction. He led the Hoosiers to three national championships, 11 Big Ten championships, and gave us some incredible moments along the way. Like his throwing the chair moment against Purdue, or his incredible national title wins. His greatest accomplishment had to have been the 1975-76 national championship run, where the Hoosiers began as the preseason number one and carried the rank all the way through till Knight earned his first and school's third NCAA championships. The, the squad marked a record of 32-0 for the entire season. Additionally, Knight brought us many two other titles, one in 1980, where the, his team brought down a powerful North Carolina Tar Heels squad. Bob Knight symbolizes all that is the great original history of Assembly Hall. Assembly Hall is one of the greatest places, if not the best place, to watch a college basketball game. However, it has become a little outdated since its original construction in 1971. So in 2016, Assembly Hall underwent a major renovation that cost a total of $35 million. When this project started, the main goal of our leadership and um, of really the university was to preserve Assembly Hall as one of the greatest um, places to play basketball in college athletics. And I think that this project is going to do that. It's going to improve the game experience for our student athletes, for our fans, for our staff, for our students um, in general. And I think it's really exciting. Here are some new features inside Assembly Hall that were added during the new renovation. You're going to find wider walkways, easier uh, ways to get to your seat, whether it's escalators, wide staircases. Uh, you're going to have increased visibility with a much bigger, larger scoreboard that's going to provide more information to you over the course of the game, to having a glass to see through rather than uh, rod iron. You're going to have more restrooms, more convenient uh, concession stands and easier places to put ketchup on your hot dog. Even though a lot of changes were done to the arena, the goal was to preserve the same feel of being at an Indiana basketball game. Here are some further details about what was done inside the arena and around the court. One of the main goals of this project was to kind of keep the court the same. So the arena hasn't changed too much, um, but we will have some pretty interesting improvements. All of the seat backs and seat pans and the chairs have all been changed out. Very excited about that. And they're really the two major changes. So you'll see a ton of stuff outside the arena, but inside the arena, the tradition um, of Assembly Hall and Indiana basketball will be pretty much the same. You know, before the season's even started, you know, we're, we're thinking of ourselves as the hunter still.
What do you hope this program looks like? National title. This is Indiana.